How are we doing guys and girls? Uh, I don't want to spend too long talking here, right? Uh, the new teaser trailer for, the first teaser trailer for Todd Phillips' Joker starring Joaquin Phoenix is live, it's up. Let's watch it. Oh, I'm so excited. Arthur, does it help to have someone to talk to? My mother always tells me he just looks like a broken man. He really does. Broken man. Face. You feel sorry for him. And then again, place. do you want to feel sorry for the Joker? Maybe. Maybe not. After enjoy to the world. <laughs> Ouch. Is it just me? Or is it getting crazier out there? Smile, though your heart is aching. Smile, even though it's breaking. Perfect song. Perfect song. In the sky, you'll get by Heart. if you smile. Not to your fear and sorrow. Oh, wow. And another laugh. What's so funny? Freak. <laughs> Gotham has lost its way. What kind of coward would do something that cold blooded? Someone who hides behind a mask. And now I realize it's a comedy. Oh, he looks beautiful. Just full on choker modes. You just beautiful. Well, that looks impressive. Um, very, it looks like it's going to be a, a lot darker. Very dark. I mean, it's supposed to be R in America, R-rated. So that's full on brutal, meant to be. Um, yeah, it looks like it's going to push some boundaries. I mean, it does look very art house, very artsy fartsy. But then again, that could be the new take on the DC universe because I feel as though Warner Brothers are just throwing out ideas of what can we do to make this better? What can we do to compete against the MCU? And this could be their new wee take on how to compete against the MCU. It does look very impressive. Uh, Todd Phillips, obviously, we know him from The Hangover um, and many other fun films, but he's also done comedies, whereas this looks very dark and sinister. Uh, you kind of feel as though you're led to believe that you want to feel sorry for the Joker and then realise that maybe you shouldn't feel sorry for him. Um... But then again, everyone has that bad day and you feel as though maybe that is going to be his bad day that he just cracks. Like Michael Douglas in Falling Down, he just he just cracks and just goes on a killing spree. Um, it does look, it looks beautiful. Great film. Just, I, I think it's going to be a winner. Um, could be an Oscar winner. You never know. I mean, these could, they could push for an Oscar nomination for something. Uh, best actor, Joaquin Phoenix. Uh, best director, best script, whatever. But no, I like the fact that Thomas Wayne is... Um, Looks like he's going to be the shame on uh, these freaks in masks, these freaks in makeup. Um, so it's kind of funny because he's kind of like what the the police were like when Batman first risen rose. Um, but no, Thomas Wayne is supposed to be have a big role in this. Uh, sadly, Alec Baldwin couldn't play him. He's now played by I don't even know the guy's name. It does look quite good, but Alec Baldwin no. Um, there's a wee boy though, um, seen through a fence that the Joker kind of does this and forces a smile onto him. Are we led to believe that is uh, Bruce Wayne, young Bruce Wayne? Could the Joker murder Bruce's parents at the end of this film that sets up a whole new chain? <gasps> maybe. Shh, spoilers, maybe. 
Uh, but yeah, it looks like the it looks like Joaquin Phoenix is kind of forcing a smile on, forcing himself to smile, have a have a nice day, have a good day, and then he just cracks. No, looks good, very impressive.